Hi, my name is Joseph Scholz, the Director at QED Environmental Services, and today I'd like to talk about indoor environment building rating schemes. Now, rating buildings for energy is becoming far more universal thanks to Neighbours Energy in Australia and international standards like Leeds and others. Now, we're all familiar with the benefits to prospective tenants being able to compare buildings for their energy use for on a like-for-like -like basis when making leasing decisions. We can easily understand that a five-star building is more efficient than a four-star building. But what about the advantages to building occupants and owners to tangibly measure improvements in employee performance? In my opinion, indoor environment is frankly more important to tenants than energy use because it has more impact on their bottom line. Academic studies have shown that declining indoor environment quality lowers productivity and the quality of higher cognitive tasks. Now looking at this logically, most of a company's cost is in the salaries of its people. Improving the productivity of office workers by 1% has a larger profit impact than saving 1% of energy in the same building. So, because it's so important, how about rating buildings for indoor environment quality? What rating schemes are available and how do they compare? Well, in this video, I'll discuss three prominent rating schemes in Australia. The Neighbours Indoor Environment, Green Star Performance and the Well Building Standard. Green Star and Neighbours are the predominant rating tools in Australia today, though Well is generating lots of buzz at the moment as the new kid on the block. Green Star may be used to rate both designs and the finished product, while in contrast, Neighbours is focused on the performance of existing buildings. The Well Building Standard is more all-encompassing of wellness and includes design and performance verification. Now, Neighbours has measurements for thermal comfort, air quality, acoustic comfort, lighting quality and office layout. The Green Star Performance recognises Neighbours as a compliance pathway so the tools are complementary. However, a Green Star rating goes further to include other aspects of sustainability such as management systems and materials and land use and the like. Now, the major elements of a Green Star rating are the quality of indoor air, the provision of outside air, mechanically ventilated or mixed mode spaces, exhaust or elimination of pollutants, thermal comfort, acoustic comfort, occupant satisfaction via surveys, emissions, refrigerant impact and microbial control. Well also utilises a performance-based system that measures buildings across seven well-being areas of air, water, nourishment, light, fitness, mind and comfort. The standard considers 102 features for the well certification based on a range of medical studies that arguably give substantial weight to what many designers have always believed. Many of the well features are based on existing government standards as well as other key industry standards. Well ratings are underway in a handful of buildings in Australia with the results yet to be published, but it is looking good. Now for more information, visit qed.com.au.